Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, trapezoid uh, A, B, C, D. As you can see in this given diagram, such that uh, this base uh, A, B is parallel to this base uh, C, D. And furthermore, uh, the base A, B length uh, is uh, 8 units. The base uh, C, D length uh, is uh, 13 units. And furthermore, uh, this side AD length is 5 units. And finally, this side BC length is 6 units. And now our task is to calculate the area of this uh, trapezoid ABCD. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started and here's our very first step since we are interested in calculating the area of this uh, given trapezoid ABCD. And now let's recall the area of a trapezoid formula. Area is always equal to the height H times the sum of the bases A and B all over 2. And here we can see our base A length is 8 units. Our base uh, B length uh, is uh, 13 and our height uh, of this trapezoid is being represented by lowercase uh, h and now our task is uh, to calculate the height uh, of this uh, trapezoid. So therefore we are going to draw some auxiliary lines to make our job simpler. As you can see in this uh, next step I have drawn this segment uh, EB such that uh, this segment EB is uh, parallel to this uh, side uh, AD. So therefore uh, this segment uh, EB length is going to be equal to this side uh, AD length which is uh, 5. So therefore uh, this EB length is 5. And now let's make an observation. We can see that this segment uh, DE length uh, is going to be equal to this base uh, AB length which is 8 so therefore uh, DE length is going to be 8 and we know this whole uh, base CD length uh, is uh, 13 so therefore uh, this uh, segment uh, CE length is going to be 13 minus 8 is going to give us uh, 5 and now let's focus on this uh, triangle uh, EBC and we are going to calculate the area of this uh, triangle uh, EBC. So therefore we are going to apply the Heron's uh, formula to calculate the area of this uh, triangle uh, EBC. And here's the area of the triangle formula, the square root of uh, S times uh, S minus A times S minus B times uh, S minus C, where this uh, semi-perimeter S uh, is always equal to a plus b plus c all over 2 and now i'm going to label this side uh, lowercase a this side uh, lowercase b and this side uh, lowercase c let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this formula so our s value is going to be equal to a value is 5 b value is 5 c value is 6 uh, all over 2 so therefore our S value is going to be 16 divided by 2 is going to give us S equals to 8. And now in this uh, next step I am going to substitute this uh, S equals to 8 value in this uh, formula. So I am going to replace S uh, by 8 and over here S with 8 over here A value is uh, 5. S value is 8 uh, and our B value is 5 as well. S value is 8 uh, and we are going to replace uh, C value with uh, 6 over here. As you can see in this uh, next step. And now let's simplify. 8 minus 5 is going to give us uh, 3. 8 minus 5 is once again 3 and 8 minus 6 is uh, 2. So therefore we could write this one as uh, 8 times uh, 3 times 3 once again and then uh, times uh, 2 
and if we multiply all these numbers that is going to give us uh, 144 so therefore uh, the area of this uh, triangle uh, ABC is going to be the square root of 144 and simply the area is going to be equal to 12 so thus the area of this uh, triangle uh, EBC simply turns out to be 12 and in this uh, next step I have dropped uh, this perpendicular uh, BF uh, on this base uh, CE and I'm going to label uh, this perpendicular uh, BF uh, as uh, lowercase h height and now our task is to find the value of this height uh, h and now let's recall the area of a triangle formula area is always equal to half times the uh, base times the height of the triangle and here uh, the base of this triangle is uh, 5 the height of this triangle is lowercase h and the area of this triangle is uh, 12 so therefore we are going to fill in the blanks in this uh, triangle formula so the area is uh, 12 is going to be equal to a half times uh, our base uh, is 5 times our height uh, lowercase h so therefore we can write uh, 5 divided by 2 times uh, h equals uh, to 12 and now I'm going to multiply both sides by the reciprocal 2 divided by 5 on the left hand side and times 2 divided by 5 on the right hand side as well. And here we can see 2 fifth and 5 divided by 2 they cancel each other out. So therefore our height uh, h value is going to be 24 divided by 5 and here's our final step now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, trapezoid uh, ABCD and now let's recall the area of a trapezoid formula once again area equals to height H uh, times A plus B all over 2 and here uh, our height uh, H value is 24 divided by 5 our A value is 8 and B value is 13 so thus our uh, trapezoid uh, ABCD area is going to be equal to our height is 24 divided by 5 and then divided by 2 times our A value is 8 plus B value is 13 and now we can see 24 divided by 5 divided by 2 is going to give us uh, 24 divided by 10 and uh, 8 plus 13 is going to give us uh, 21 so therefore this is going to give us uh, 24 divided by 10 times uh, 21 and that's going to be equal to 504 divided by 10 and that's going to be equal to 50.4 square units the area of this trapezoid ABCD so thus after all the calculations and manipulations the trapezoid ABCD area turns out to be 50.4 square units in other words uh, this trapezoid area is going to be equal to 50.4 square units and that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.